hello guys welcome back to my channel today in this video guide i will show you how to fix animal shelter 2 crashing or not launching error on pc or stuck on loading screen error so let's go ahead the first method is to restart your pc for that simply click on the windows icon over here and then click on power and then select restart option this will close your pc and restart it once your system restarts now launch the game and then check if the issue is resolved the second method suggested is to run game as administrator for that you simply go to steam under library section select the game you have downloaded right click on it select properties and then click on install files next click on browse and it will land you to the folder where your game has been downloaded now select the game application right click on it and select properties in the compatibility section click on run this program as an administrator and then click on apply and ok otherwise you can also click on run this program in compatibility mode 4 and then select windows 8 and then click on apply and ok after doing this launch the game and check if this resolves the issue if not the next method suggested is to verify integrity of game files for that go to steam go to the library section select your game right click on it select properties now click on install files over here and then click on verify, verify integrity of game files this will verify the game files of your game after doing this launch the game and check if it works next solution is to disable in-game overlays for that again go to steam under library section select the game right click on it select properties and under general disable enable the steam overlay while in game option after this try to launch the game and check if it works for you or even uh, if you are using geforce experience then simply go open it tap on the gear icon beside username click on general and then switch off in game overlay options from here or if you are a discord user then for discord overlay go to the user settings then click on game overlay tab here switch off enable in game overlay option the next solution suggested is to allow the game through firewall for that go to the search option click on windows defender firewall or if not then search here after that click on window allow an app or feature through windows defender firewall now click on change settings here look if your game has been added as you can see the game ha has been added into the list if not then you can also add the game by clicking on allow another app from here click on browse and then add it so the game has been added simply click on it and then select both public and private boxes and first click on ok and then try to launch the game and check if this works if not the next method is to update graphics card for that you simply go to the search option and here search for device manager now expand display adapters here right click on your graphics card click on update driver option after that click on search automatically for drivers this will update your driver to the latest version and after that launch the game and check if this solution works for you or even you can go directly through the link that i have given in the description simply download and install the latest drivers on your pc the next solution is to modify launch option for that go to steam under library section select the game select the game right click on it select properties and under general in the launch option type minus dx11 and then try to check the game if it works if not type minus dx12 and then try to launch the game and check if this solution works 
to fix the issue. The next solution is to clear download cache. For that, simply go to settings, steam and click on steam option, then click on settings. Now click on downloads and here we need to go down and select clear cache option under clear download cache. Once done, now check if you can play the game. The next solution suggested is to run game on dedicated graphics card. For that, you need to click on the search option, search for graphic settings. Here you need to add the game to the list. So simply click on add desktop app, go to program files. Now click on steam, then click on steam apps, go to common and here you can find your game application. Simply click on it and add it to here and after that click on the arrow icon under GP preference select high performance and then try to play the game and check if this works for you. The next solution is to close unnecessary background task. This is also an important step as background apps somewhere impacts the game performance. So simply click over here, click on task manager. Under processes tab here you should check if any of the unwanted apps is consuming high resources or is of no use. Simply select it, right click on it and then click on end task. This will completely close the app from your system and then try to launch the game and play it. Next is to check for updating windows so simply click on the search option, search for check for updates and this will open the windows update tab simply here click on check for updates option and if any update is available simply download to the latest version and then try to launch the game and check if it works next solution is to install visual c++ i have provided the link in the description just go through the disk link open it download and install the latest visual c++ files for a system if not, the final solution suggested is to reinstall the game. So for that, simply go to Steam, under library section, select the game, right click on it, click on manage and then click on uninstall option. And again, this kind of interface will open, simply click on uninstall. This will remove the game from your PC. Now restart your system and then again try to launch the game and play it to check if the same issue occurs or you can play it without any further problem. So all these are the best solutions suggested to fix Animal Shelter 2 crashing or not launching or stuck on loading screen error on PC. So that's all for now. Thank you.